Have you ever wanted to customize your minifigures with capes or karmas, only to find out you don't have the cape you need in your collection? It's too expensive to buy from Bricklink? Or Lego just never made it? That's where Capes for Minifigs comes in. Packaged very nicely in this envelope is a small selection of some of their custom capes and karmas. Here we can see the different variety of capes and colours they are produced in. Firstly, I want to take a look at this standard olive cape that I bought for my custom Faramir figure. When we compare it to LEGO's official olive cape, we see that it is quite a bit darker. Also a bit thicker. And a bit longer too. However, for about 72 cents USD, compared to $7.95 USD for a used official cape, you really can't go wrong. Next up is one of the capes I ordered for my two General Grievous figures, replicating the cape that came in set 7255. We can see again that it is slightly darker in colour than LEGO's, but LEGO's official one is also quite rare and expensive, coming in at $14.39 USD on Bricklink, compared to about $2.30 USD. But LEGO never made a cape for the newer version of Grievous, which Capes for Minifigs does. At first I was disappointed that the cape wouldn't stay on properly, but quickly found that tucking it into the back of his feet got it to stay. I also folded it a bit to help it maintain its shape. This is also by far my favourite cape in the order. I think it elevates the figure by giving him a more imposing presence. Now moving on to the Karmas. I wanted to upgrade my 501st officers and 187th commanders slash airborne troopers. While I was at it, I also decided to update the antennas on my officers, just to make them look more accurate to their appearance in Battlefront 2. Unfortunately, after I ordered these karmas, I decided to make a custom Commander Bly, so one of my airborne troopers is left without one, since I'm using it on Bly instead. Oh, it's beautiful. I've also got some black karmas here for my wolf figures. A day after filming this, I did receive their proper torsos, so the completed wolf figures actually look like this. Finally, Fives, he also gets a black karma, but in addition to a specialized pauldron piece, replicating the one that came from the Ark Trooper in set 9488. And this pauldron looks much better proportioned than the two Death Trooper ones I was using, which were just too large in my opinion. So that's just a brief look at these custom capes. In my opinion for the price, these capes are very hard to beat. I usually store away my official Lego capes out of fear of damaging them, just knowing how expensive some of them can be to replace. But that fear simply doesn't exist with these capes, and better yet, they look just as good as the official ones in my opinion. Also, the fact that we can get different colours that LEGO never produced some capes in is also a major benefit, especially for the Karmas. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.